Hey everyone, welcome back to one of these kinds of videos again. I'm probably going to be doing a lot of these videos, and I want you guys to leave some suggestions down in the comments, and I'll try to choose some to make videos on about, about my, my thoughts on that specific subject. But for today, we are going to be doing gender equality. Now, it is a thing, you know, everybody has their genders and everything. Everybody believes different things about different genders, as you know it, you know. There's people who are transgender, there's, you know, obviously females, males, people who identify as completely different things. And what I think about gender equality as of today, it is terrible. There is no real gender equality, and there's a lot more punishment and I'm not being, you know, sexist or anything. I feel like there's a lot more punishment towards men doing crimes. And um, and also, just by the color of your skin, too, can also kind of just make you have a lot more punishments than other people. But also, like, with most genders, it is a lot of men getting longer, you know, sentences in jail and, like, harder things by their opposing genders rather than women getting a lot. I know women are vulnerable and everything, but, you know, men have feelings too. And I'm not just saying that just because I'm a guy. I'm just making my honest thoughts. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm going to say everything I'm going to say. And um, either way, um, gender equality, it's, it, it's, it's kind of like a weird thing to kind of explain. Some, like, a good example is, let's just say, um, like, a man or a woman had rape charges. For example, let's just say a man raped a woman. They got 10, 20 years in jail, probably. For a woman, it's actually a lot less for some reason. And I don't really get why. If there's gender equality, shouldn't there be equal times in jail for both genders? Like, if you make an average of, like, a 3 to 20, that's, like, a 11, 12, 13-year average inside of jail. And it obviously it's well-deserved, but, you know, if you're not going to make it equal for both gender, for both genders to be treated equal, then it's not going to work out for anyone. People are going to transgender, probably, mainly from men to women, so they don't have, you know, a lot harder times. And I'm not, I'm not, you know, being sexist or anything here, but... Also, I kind of noticed this a lot, that I think women, personally, get a lot more compliments from men than men do women, or really women do men, or however you want to say it. Like, let's just say, you know, a man gives a woman a life-changing compliment, and they're like, oh, thank you, I'm going to remember that for the rest of my life, and I'm going to keep that with me. You know, you don't really see many guys getting life-changing compliments from women. And I'm just going to say, any woman watching this, like, you know, let's just say, for example, reloading in my chat, Rock Lee chat, Rock Lee Tack in my chat and everything, I'm not targeting you guys, okay? I'm just giving my personal thoughts. And you kind of don't see many compliments given to guys. You do see a lot given to girls, obviously, because they are vulnerable, you know? They create us. And, you know, as much as they are fragile and have a lot of mental thoughts sometimes going around because other guys give, you know, a lot worse things to them and other girls give worse things to other girls and guys give, you know, worse to guys and girls give worse to guys as well. It, it should all be equal. It should not be, you know, just one gender is superior than the other. I, I don't think it should work like that, but... Either way, that's about it. I can't really explain it a lot because it's kind of a confusing topic to kind of descri um, describe. But either way, um, that's the end of the video. Leave your suggestions down in the comments of what you want me to do next. And have a good night, everyone. See you.